Low runners in that Cellcom Green Bay Marathon, quite a battle with Mother Nature today. Those strong winds really made that tough course, especially for the second half of the marathon. Still, those thousands of runners made it out for the race, and Fox 11's Kristen Crowley gives us a look. <laughs> it was less than an hour before race time, and the weather was less than cooperative. Crazy. It's supposed to be warm. It's May. <laughs> but runners needed to have a positive mental attitude to keep focus on the race. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. It's going to be a good run. I could trade in the wind for some rain, but we're okay. What? We'll get there. <laughs> good or bad weather, the race was on. The 12th annual Cellcom Green Bay Marathon and Half Marathon were underway. It was only a matter of time before the runners warmed up on the course, but off on the sidelines were the loving friends and family members of the racers showing their support, all the while standing and waiting in the cold. Uh, I guess think of the coldest Packer game and then dress accordingly, which we didn't do today. I was not used to it, but I came prepared. Many, many layers. While fans focused on keeping warm, runners were focused on beating the elements. You know, the course record is 104. I don't think we're going to see that broken today, unfortunately, with the weather. About one hour and six minutes into the race, a winner crossed the line, Tyler Siegel. Not far behind him at one hour and 16 minutes was Jenna Boren, the first woman to cross for the half marathon. I think you just have to kind of adapt your attitude towards it and not worry too much about your pace. I didn't even look at my watch at all during knowing that my splits were going to be way off and I didn't want to have a meltdown during all there. So Less than an hour and a half later, the marathon winner crossed the finish line. And while no records were beaten this time, it was still a proud moment for many racers in the end. In Green Bay, Kristen Crowley, Fox 11 News.